All right, thank you, Whitney. The new Illinois budget includes an additional $50 million for the Department of Children and Family Services. New this morning, local partnering organizations say they will see benefits from the increase. WGEM's Ryan Hill joins us to explain the impact. Ryan? Natalie, officials with the Advocacy Network for Children say more money from DCFS will give them some much needed help to retain staff and operations. They say the boost is needed as they have had a 16% increase in clients coming to them this year. The executive director says the extra money will allow them to offer more competitive wages. Daniel Buss, the CASA manager, says before they had 12 staff members serving nine counties. They would sometimes have to be selective about which counties to provide services in each day due to staff limitations. She says now they have 15 staff members, which allows them to offer more consistent care. On any given day, there could be all 15 of us in nine different counties um, doing services because we're able to um, use the money we have and be able to do those things to be able to get to the nine counties. Bus says the extra money will make their wages competitive and help retain experienced workers so they can continue to provide the consistent care in those counties. It will also allow them to expand mental health service programs to make them more available to local families. So they won't have to drive as far and this will allow them to recruit and hopefully find more CASA volunteers to better serve abused and neglected children navigate the court system. Now the executive director says without this additional money, their operations would see an impact. We'll have more on why in the next half hour. Ryan Hill, WGEM News. Thank you, Ryan. If you would like to reach out to the Advocacy Network for Children or help or volunteer, you can go to our website, of course, at WGEM.com.